I'm Rob Wake, Collections Facilitator at York Castle Museum. I'd like to make a case for something fundamental to our museum, the Kirk Collection of Bygones. John Lamplow Kirk was born in Hull in 1869. He studied medicine at Cambridge and worked at a number of London hospitals before he and his young family returned to Yorkshire to set up home in Pickering. Dr Kirk was a man of many pastimes, but his great passion was in collecting. Not fine art or scientific specimens, but objects that spoke of traditional ways of life in the towns, villages and farms he visited as a GP. Practices that he recognised were in danger of being forgotten amid the technological and cultural shifts of the 20th century. His home became filled with an extraordinary collection of everyday items, including agricultural tools, folk crafts, kitchen equipment, toys, musical instruments, clothing and vehicles. Looking for a permanent home for these bygones, led Dr. Kirk to York and Alderman J.B. Morell, who immediately understood the educational value of Kirk's collection and was determined to secure the disused prison buildings for the collection. In 1938, Kirk's dream became a reality, a new kind of museum centered around a recreated Victorian street built using rescued shop fronts, filled with his bygones and named Kirkgate in his honor. Sadly, Dr. Kirk passed away less than two years later, but as it says on the commemorative plaque here, if you seek his monument, look around. <laughs>